Back on while I'm changing batteries and in the and in the Kodak as well. Because it might have gone at the same time. Like I said, I was cow pack fresh cow pack down there. We haven't really got a big stretch to do now to get onto the old drove down to Cheddar. We haven't really got loads to do. But I'm the cows now. The cows weren't out last week, see? And um, they're now out. Which means the field up the hill I was going to explore and go down through, I won't be doing. I've got to try and hope I can get to the track. I've just got to hope I can get to the track without cows being all over it, if you see what I mean. Because they're quite free to roam where they want, this farmer seems to let them. He doesn't seem to care about um, pedestrians as such. So we're just going to go up through here and have a look up the field and cross the field if we can. From up here we should be able to see where the cows are. Okay. So I've changed batteries on both. I'm charging up. I don't know if Kodak needs it but I've already started to charge it up. Like I say, once we get to, unless I do the diversion down the garlic track, we don't really have to worry about doing too much because I only did it last week. Right, there's no sign of cow here, no foots, nothing. No hoof prints, no pack. So I don't know why that it started there when there's no evidence of them anywhere. It's just like they've come down here and turned around and gone back or something. I don't know. But we won't know till we get in this field. Which I've done before. I do, do, I do use this field. But we could see a massive herd in here and have to divert again. All the fences are barbed wired. Um... But there's, like I said, there's no sign of a cow in here. Not recent. Might find something in a minute. Basically, I've got to go across there. There's very little chance getting over there without cutting yourself on barbed wire. So we just follow the farmer's trail there. Keeping our eyes peeled. In case there's any cows under trees sheltering. But I know what they do. They go up that path and then straight onto the hill. Do they? Yeah. I'm just keeping an eye out. Yeah, in theory, there should be a gate up there somewhere for me to get through. What we don't want is me bumping into a herd, you see. And, and of course now I can't explore the hill properly, but I'll have to leave it to another time. Let's try and pick up this track down here so we've got some lines to follow. I mean, if I have to get over a fence, I'll get over it. There's the quarry there. There's the aerial for Shoot Shelf Hill right over there and I was staring over here not long ago. On this side though. Right at the top on the edge where the gates were. But what I was saying, that's fresh cow pack and fresh hoof marks. So Although I've often had to avoid that way, either because it's very, very muddy with the cows churning it up. So I decided to come across. If there's no cows, we should be okay. What we don't want is to get up on there and we see a herd by the gate. 
then I'll be hurtling down here. That's why I'm I'm sort of keeping careful what I'm where I'm going. I'm looking around as well. I don't want to be surrounded. Right then folks, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna turn off now. I'm following the farmer. He must have let him off somewhere. Look, cow pack there. There's nothing to say they're not gonna greet me in a minute. Okay, I need to keep near that fence really, so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna scoop round like this. I still got a feeling there's a gate in that corner as well, but I know there's one up there. But that was one old, not that old a cow pack. But I partly want to keep near this fence. I will get over it if I have to. I will just lie across my bag and do it. The farmers are often out here. I reckon they got cameras everywhere. It's got all the barbed wire look. So much barbed wire. They're into their barbed wire, this farmer. All his gates further up, covered in masses of barbed wire. It's because they got the, uh, the banger racing. I suppose they don't want all the yobs chasing their cows across fields and that. Well, I'm going to keep to the fence, even though I'm going out of my way. I just feel a bit safer if I can sort of get across the fence, even though it's barbed wire. And <laughs> look at it, loads of it. What I do, you should take wire clippers with you, shouldn't you? I get over this one first. That one I can put my feet in and grab hold the pole. I've already worked out how to get over barbed wire fences. Have you? Yeah. See, the cows have been all the way along here. But there was no sign of them coming up from the road, was there? And no sign of them coming down here either. But there could be a herd by those trees. I just need to know where the gate is. I know there's one over there, or there used to be. I can see a gate now. But I also think I can see cows in that copse there. Might be in my imagination. If I just walk gently around the edge, there might even be a gate on this corner. I think there's cows in there. I'm not sure. Well, years, a couple of years back, I had brilliant eyesight. And uh, at sniper eyes, I would have seen if that was a cow, what I'm looking at now. I'm just going to zoom in. But with no viewfinder, it's even harder. If there's any cows in there. I don't know. Beautiful view though, isn't it? And there's the quarry. There's a the quarry there. God, I smell of insect repellent. It's awful. I wonder where the cows are, but they're going to be very, right near that gate where i got to get at. Not this one. I don't know, there might be a gate up in this corner. I'm just going to, I'm just going around the edge. I feel safer if I go around the edge. Do you? Yeah. I feel safer. There is a gate, I think. This area. Have I turned off? No, you're still going, Sheila. Yeah, there, this looks like a gate there. Even a stile. Where are the cows? Where are the cows? I won't be able to walk across now, but my plan was to walk across. I'm now going to have to skirt tight, hoping that they don't... They can't really get through that gate, I don't think. There is a gate, look. You did it well, should I? If not, I think I would have had to gone right up in that corner. 
over and out for now folks right this is the closest I'm going to come to doing the hill I was going to walk over and down okay but the cows are about look I can't can't do it now there's disused quarry right over there you can't see it is the working quarry and somewhere about is a massive herd of cows and they could be anywhere it's quite a big field they might be right down the bottom now which might give us chance to skirt round the edge hopefully but um yeah they've been here they've been let out today i would think that's what it looks like that's recent but that for them to be right down there like that but i don't know how they get there like that i really don't know but um go that way Basically, I'm skirting and hoping that they're not going to be too close to the path where I've got to go in a minute. But you can see they've been everywhere. They could be right down, out the way. They could even be over that way, out the way. But I wanted to be able to get in their own room, but I won't be able to. I'm not, I will not risk it. They have been here. They could have been not that long ago. We see that more pack. But they can sometimes wander on what's supposed to be a public footpath. That's what always worries me. Look. They're actually on the public footpath. Now there's a gate there, but it still doesn't mean they can't get on the public footpath. They don't fence it off. Look how fresh that is. What's that, an hour or so? I think they haven't been here that long. I can see mountain bike tires though. Can you? Yeah. I've got to keep moving though, because I've got to remember, I've got to get a bus. That's probably still Carlo Hill, you know. Written. What's that say? Please leave the... Please shut the gate. Uh, yeah, well, maybe they are making it safe for us. <laughs> 